In today's video, we are in a dusty trip. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get really, really far in a dusty trip. So if you guys want to go 10,000 kilometers, 20,000 kilometers, 30,000 kilometers, or even 40,000, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get really, really far in the game. So there's a few things that you can actually do to get really, really far in the game. So you can be like these people and you can get really, really far in the game. As you can obviously see at the top, these people have traveled tens and thousands of meters, guys. So if you want to be like these people and travel really, really far in the game, follow what I show you in this video and I'll basically get you guys to get really, really far in the game and possibly break some road records in the game. So yeah, let's just get started, show we? As you can obviously see, guys, this is what it's like when you get 20,000 meters away. <laughs> so yeah, look, pretty sick, guys. We're gonna get this far. This is basically what you gotta do. This guy literally just got exploded. But yeah, this is what your car needs to look like, guys. Like, you need to add so much stuff to your car, such as engine, oil, gas. You guys can actually see that these people have went 30,000 meters. So look at the car, guys. The car is an absolute mess, and I'm not sure if you guys know this already. I'm gonna show you some tips in this video so you can just become like really, really overpowered because I'm pretty sure you guys didn't know some other tips that I'm gonna be showing you in this video. So, yeah, I mean, it's pretty much simple to get really, really far in the game, guys, but something that a lot of you guys probably don't know. Let me just see if this actually works, guys. So, I'm pretty sure if you literally just attach this anywhere on your car like that. And you turn on the headlights of a car. So let's just turn it on. So I'm pretty sure it usually works, guys, if you do that. It doesn't need to be attached onto the actual car and the headlight to just start working. The reason why this is really important is because in the dark, guys, you really do need to see in the dark, guys. But yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this, guys, that you can literally just add to your car. And it literally glows up anywhere, which is pretty sick. So let's see if we can literally attach it to the car. And let's see if it does light up or not. So let's go ahead. Let's try and attach it right there. Is it going to get attached or is it not? But yeah, if you do attach headlights like that to your car. And you turn on headlights, I'm pretty sure it doesn't even need to get attached, guys, for it to turn on. Let's just give it another try, guys. So yeah, if you want to put headlight on the back or something, and you just turn on headlight button, it should actually get turned on. I'm pretty sure it's not working because there's obviously no gas in the car. But yeah, all I can say for you guys to get really, really far in the game, what you basically need, guys, is just whenever you see an engine, guys, even if you've already got an engine in your car, make sure you're collecting engines, make sure you're collecting these, water, and radiators if you've got one of these with water in make sure you just collect it just attach it on the car guys okay it's really easy to attach it to the car just do that and to be fair it's down to luck guys if you do run out of fuel you can also go ahead and just buy emergency res resupply of gas that comes with water oil as well as other stuff you can just keep on buying those and you can just get to like 50,000 meters which is really really easy but yeah, as you can obviously see, guys, I did do the method. I got really, really far. I did end up getting to like 30,000 meters. And yeah, as you can obviously see on the screen right now, guys, I got really, really far. And I highly recommend you getting a V8 engine for your car or van because this will help you drive faster and get to like higher meters really, really quickly as you're driving at like 100 miles an hour. And yeah, it would just help you out a lot by doing that. So yeah, all I can say for you guys to do to get really, really far in the game, love the people that you see on the screen right now, is just do the methods that I told you. And by just following the methods that I showed you, you will become really, really overpowered. But yeah, in the new update, guys, I'm not sure if you know this already, but there's a video on my channel right now. And the whole game is going to be changed. And I highly recommend you guys, if you are watching this video and the game has updated, what you would need to do, guys, is this. You might think that I'm joking, but once this game does update, you will need to attach random stuff to your car, such as planks of wood. You might think that I'm joking, guys, but you actually need to attach planks of wood to your car. Unfortunately, like this, guys, you'll literally need to do that for a reason, because it's because 
I'll, if I do remember to, I'll put a clip on the screen on what will be coming in the next update. So if you guys are watching the video, um, if you guys are watching this video and the new update is out, this is why you need to attach stuff to your car because soldiers will start shooting your car and your car is just going to get absolutely destroyed if you don't add random parts to your car. So I highly recommend you guys using van parts and just attaching them to your car like that. So your car is armored from these soldiers, so you can get really, really far in the game. So yeah, that is pretty much how you get really, really far in the game. For thank you guys so much for watching. Just main thing that you need, guys, is water, oil, and gas. You don't really need food. You don't really need extra tires as long as you drive normally. And yeah, that's basically all you need, guys. And you also need rope hook to call in them airstrikes. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and peace out.